Howdy y'all, welcome to Bastion Time. This is the Cowboy Week of Zelda news, only because uh, for Halloween I was originally planning on being Link for the third time in a row, but plans didn't quite work out so well. Uh, my new Link costume uh, wasn't ready, so I defaulted to generic cowboy. Howdy. So let's get to that first story. In the spirit of Halloween last week, I have a quick little um, jack-o'-lantern, or maybe we should call it link-o'-lantern, uh, uh, series of images for you. Um, basically, two amazing pumpkin carvings caught my eye this past week, and I just had to share them with you. This version of uh, Toon Link, I think this is from Phantom Hourglass. I think the fairy is probably silly and not, not Navi, but... Um, uh, anyways, fantastic job. I mean, just amazing. My Zelda pumpkin was just a Triforce, and uh, not a very good one at that. I didn't get the Triforces um, equal. Uh, they were not equal at all Triforces. There were some Asasi's ones in there. But um, anyways, uh, fantastic job. And then this pumpkin carving is, of course, the Hylian Shield and Jeez Louise that's just awesome. Really awesome pumpkin carvings out there by some Zelda fans. There are a few more really awesome ones down in the link below. Also speaking of Halloween, uh, Dorkly Bits had a quick little um, video of various video game characters trick-or-treating or involved in Halloween activities in some way. So of course they had Link and Zelda trick-or-treating with some pretty amusing consequences. Uh, definitely check this one out. There's the link down below for you. And then one more sort of Halloween-related uh, thing, and it's this uh, very humorous Zelda shirt, which uh, takes a undead spin on the legend, the legends of Zombie, wherein Link apparently has been bitten by a redead, and is now redead himself. Um, yikes. Next up is a very unusual Grand Theft Auto mod, which puts Link into the game, and not just Link, but it's not really just a mod that shoves Link into the game, but really instead it's a whole adventure um, with its own plots involving other familiar Zelda characters. So um, it's pretty a pretty bizarre combo, but uh, seems kind of interesting. So if you're a Grand Theft Auto fan, a Zelda fan, probably going to want to check this one out. Then our final story is uh, this amazing sapphire uh, ring, of course, is based on the, uh, the spiritual stone that you get from uh, Princess Ruto, and wow, it's just beautiful. Uh, if you know any Zora princesses that you'd like to uh, get engaged to, here's your chance. There's a link for you down below for checking that out. So that's it for this episode of Zelda News. Of course, tomorrow is the second Nintendo News episode. I'll see you then. So long.